Good morning, it is Monday and it is the start of a week so welcome to a new weekly vlog. I'm currently, um, did I say good morning? It's afternoon, <laughs> it's four o'clock. Um, just had like a morning of getting ready and editing the vlog which takes ages but I've got a really busy week this week. Um, I am working but next this time next week I will be either in Gran Canaria or travelling there. Um, so that's exciting. Um, yeah, so I've got a week of uploading an art vlog, sorting everything out before I go away, packing, um, editing my video for next week. So it's quite busy. And then I've got the handmade craft event um, on Saturday. So that'll be in this vlog. So. Exciting times! I'll update you later. It is Monday evening now and I'm just having my dinner which is mac and cheese and i um, watching some Phil DeFranco. DeFranco, if I can say it right. <laughs> um, I noticed in my last vlog I didn't really do any evening bits. Um, work was so tiring today. It's kind of, I do the refunds and exchanges and it's mental because it's just kind of me on the tools in the evening and um yeah it's it's mental it's good it's good fun um but it's like oh my god i've got so much to do it's a little time so i am tired now so i'm gonna watch some youtube eat my dinner maybe play some rimworld i know i should probably pack i think i'm gonna play some rimworld because i've done work today um, upload my vlog and then tomorrow I'm working on the um, Muffalo piece so hopefully I can get quite far with that and then tomorrow evening I can kind of it's not so tiring so hopefully I don't know I'll have to pack at some point <laughs> I do I that does remind me that I do need to sort out my car insurance and um, I'm ordering stuff online so I might do that now I'll do that now. I'll do the ordering online. I don't do my car insurance until I've eaten this because I'm hungry and I've been working. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end the vlog. Uh, well, I'm not going to end the vlog, but I'm going to end Monday night here. And I'll see you tomorrow at Tuesday. Hey guys, it is now Tuesday morning. And um, I am going to be painting today. And then working later, I'm working on my um, muffalo piece. And, sorry. And um, last night I was working out my car insurance. I worked out I can pay in full, so that's really good. Um, then also i am been looking at bikinis because I'm going away next week. And I know it's late, so currently going to be looking at that now. I'm, I'm currently on eBay looking. It's just one of those things where you're just like, ugh, I knew I should have done it earlier, but i do it now. It's either not of my size or it's not. It's going to be here way too late. I mean, one was like, oh, I'll be here by November. November? It's like September. Crazy. Anyway, I will check you in later on. I finally bought a bikini. I'm just sick of it now. <laughs> Let's have a look. Try and find it for you guys. And it is like the most expensive bikini I've ever bought. <laughs> but I'm just in need of one. And it looks like. Can you see that guy's okay? Kind of can't see the white, but it's kind of flowy. Uh, I like bigger bottoms just because I don't really like showing off. Oh, too much stir there. So now I can finally get on to my artwork. Yay, it's done! Oh no, I'm gonna I'm gonna sort out my insurance now. Go compare. I hate using go compare because I hate the adverts. But um you know it's just gotta be done. Finally, my insurance is sorted so I can start painting! Yes! 
oh, it's it's been painful. <laughs> I got it down to like nearly 500 quid yesterday and now I'm paying another like 100 quid just overnight and it's just ugh, the worst. So anyway, gonna start painted. Woo! So yeah, I will check in with you guys later. Good noon o'clock. Um, it is now Thursday. Yes, yeah, it's first day because it's upload day. Um, I didn't film yesterday because I was basically painting all day and I've just edited my muffalo piece which will be going up later and then I'll be editing next week's piece so I can get that all ready and scheduled and everything for next week um, and then I think I might um, pack today. I've also got work today, um, today as well um, but that should be fine because that's a lot later on. It was yawn. It was yawn when I edit this sort of stuff. Um, yes, so that's all good. It's all going well. I'm currently sort of, obviously I'm repainted those bits. I'm painting my nails for the holiday. Just doing a mint colour again. I've done this for my last couple of um, holidays. I use um, Essie ones and I've used mint candy apple and it came in a pack and it comes with this glitter one which is just sparkle on top um so i think i'll just do that again it's really nice my swim suit came yesterday so woo <laughs> it's weird i'm trying to do like my hand but i don't want to ruin it um i just came yesterday with foundation and stuff and some sunglasses so that's cool um but yeah so at the editing now, I've changed it to like a light six screen, so actually it's quite nice to see that during the day because I get a lot of reflections here with the window. But yeah. So um, I've only uploaded my one video today, so that's my muffalo piece. I haven't ed fully edited the um, seasonal depression piece yet, which will be up on Thursday. Um, but it, I'll get it done later on after work because I've got to go to work now. But I watched Loose Women and um, had lunch, had halloumi. Mm -mm, I love halloumi. But I've decided to do my hair in pigtails so I hope I don't get too cold at work because I know there is air con. But anyway, I will see you later on. <laughs> it is Friday. I can't believe it's Friday already. Um, it is gone quickly this week. And... I'm tired. I have slept in. <sighs> I always yawn. I feel like as soon as I pick up the camera, I yawn. Um, yeah. I need to go to Tesco today. Um, get my sunscreen. I really hope they sell sunscreen. They should do. Um, get my euros. and get food. I haven't eaten today so I'm going to go there when I'm hungry which is probably the worst idea ever but it's now half twelve. I need to get done. I'm busy tomorrow at the craft fair and then I have Sunday to edit this vlog. Hello Sunday me. Um and then I have uh, to pack. I haven't even started packing yet. So I'm, I want, every day this week I've been like, I want to start packing today. I haven't started packing today. Um, I'm hoping the video for next week, I want to get that done first. Um, won't take me too long. And I can start packing today. I also need to get ready for tomorrow. I have just gotten back from Tesco, um, I've got my Euros, um, I've got my sunscreen and I've got my lunch, so that's really cool. Um, so first of all I had to get cash out and the machine only gave £5 notes, like what machine does that? <laughs> so I had to give this guy like loads of money in £5 notes, I was like, you go. <laughs> Um, just know there's a spider. Hello, Mr. Spider. It's right behind. Behind, well, 
It's one of those skinny leg ones, it's not right, but I keep getting spiders everywhere. Then, um, so that was fine. Um, so that's all sorted, my euros are sorted, that's great, because I was a bit worried, because I didn't know if Tesco would be doing it on Sundays, and I'm going, I didn't want to chance it, basically. Um, but it does get confusing, because uh, it's just confusing changing up money. Anyway, it's all sorted. Then I got my sunscreen, so as you can tell, I am very, very pale, and I, working with, as a hairdresser, I meet a lot of people and stuff like that, and the amount of stories about skin cancer and not looking after your skin and stuff like that has just put me in a, I'd rather be safe than sorry, so I do a factor 50, um, it's a spray on one, and I was really worried when I walked into Tesco, and, um, I was like, fingers crossed, it's not the biggest Tesco in the world, but um, they do have a skincare range, so I was like, okay, they better have it. Um, so I went in there and I was like, oh, like I don't see any of like the thing, because it's September now, they wouldn't be selling skincare, and I luckily went down the baby aisle, because that was where it was all this prescription stuff. So it's like, maybe they've put here. It was in the reduced clear. So I got this at, like, less than half price or half price. And yeah, yeah. So I got two. Because I never know. This is clearly going to be enough for a week. But you never know. You're just like, it's for me and Ashton. Um, so I got this. I was tempted by the mini one, but minis always tempt me and I'm like, I don't need a mini. This is an okay size to carry around. Um, I do have two, I already have two little minis from Poundland that are like 50 for your face. Um, but yeah, I do care a lot about sun care because I don't tan. I burn. So... I need the best, <laughs> I just need 50, okay, and um, it's more about um, sort of length of time and stuff like that rather than how much it protects factors apparently, like don't take this as fact, but um, yeah, so taking this and um, my partner, he's South African so he does turn, um, but at the same time he's wearing sunscreen like it really pees me off when I go abroad and people are like well I want to tan like, I used to be like that as a kid because I thought wearing this blocks it can you can still get a tan by wearing this um not as much with, with the 50 so that's why you want to go d lower but as a as some people would call me a British rose or yeah I think it's a British rose I just don't the sky the sun like, I go out with my boyfriend, he loves the sun because he's able to deal with it. I go out and I'm just like, ah, shh. like my skin doesn't understand it. My body doesn't understand the heat, so therefore, I need it. But at the same time, even though he can handle the heat, so for that he's still wearing sunscreen because I'm not having any issues in either the future when we're this age, because it can happen at any age, based more on the story, kids. We're going into autumn, but why is sunscreen when it's hot? Not all the time. I don't get it when people wear it all the time. Unless you're in a hot country. In Britain, I mean, it's cloudy now. We don't really have that problem. If I got sunburnt now, I would be like... It wouldn't be a sunburn. I just wouldn't even be convinced it was a sunburn. Anyway. On other news, I went downstairs. So, my shop I work in, they had a blown up, un well, they don't have it blown up, but in a box, they have blown up unicorn um, for pool stuff. It's like a pool ring, but it's not actually a ring. Anyway, so they had that for 10 quid, and I was like, I'm not paying 10 quid for it, I'm going away for a week. So I went online, I was like, there's one cheaper, it's about £7. I've ordered it. Then one of my colleagues come up to me yesterday to buy one. I was like, it's five quid. Five quid. Why does this happen to me? They never put it... Well, they did put this one down. But they never put it down when 
I want it to get. <laughs> I have another little letter. Oh. It's my baby. No. Did you just? That is so cheeky. They just put in half a bag and then it didn't even come out. Next week's vlog, guys. My baby will be blown up. I don't want to unfold it too much. You can see a flash of gold. And it smells like plastic. If I get there and they're like, no pool toys, I will be like, um, seven cold. So this is a letter. I have a feeling it's from Ellie. I could be wrong. Ellie is Lincoln Poop, you should know her by now. Um, it could be wrong. I think it's her handwriting. No one ever writes me letters. But I don't know what it is. What is it? Mm. It's a little card. What? Oh, these are so cute! Oh, look at it! That is so cute! I, is it like a magnet? It's got a little magnet. That is adorable. I always like her icon. So cute. I got a little. Got a love letter. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Look at the little hamster! Damn, can you stop being so good at drawing? Like, no. <laughs> I'm not gonna read it out because it's for me. It's for my love letter. <laughs> anyway, I feel that's to put me in a right good mood now. I'm taking a video. We're stuck in traffic. <laughs> the first thing we went to was actually willow weaving, which mine didn't go overly very well, and we had to run to to get to. But we made them into Christmas trees, which was really actually a fun technique to actually learn. <laughs> Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed this week's video. I've not vlogged the Sunday because it is Sunday today and um, I'm editing today and packing for my holiday. So that's why this one is up early. Next week um, will be up late because I will be traveling and then editing and everything will be delayed a little bit. But um, next week is more exciting because I am off in Gran Canaria. So if you want to see that, please subscribe. Also, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and let me know if you would like to go to the handmade craft fair as well. It was really good fun yesterday and I hope you enjoyed this. And I will see you guys next week when it's a little bit more hot and sunny.